Hello everybody, welcome back to Blade and Soul guys and we are just to finish chapter 3 and if you remember we left it here and uh, we came through that portal we killed a couple of guys here on this uh, outlook post or whatever it was and we are going just about to fire the cannon at the Black Ram flagship and this is what we are going to do guys do it What a shot, guys. Beautiful. Look at that. Awesome. What's that? Uh, do we need to kill this dude? Oh, of course we have to. Right, we did it, did we? Is that? Yeah, or well, is that? It's gone at least, so... And the boat is destroyed completely. Yeah, I love destruction in this game. Awesome, let's speak to Dodan. them sailing away like cowards wow Juan was upset <laughs> where'd he go anyway and who is one you don't know Guan? right you're from a mountain or something he's the leader of the black ram in the area he's pretty tough <laughs> he says he says you're from a mountain or something oh god really it's a good thing you injured him with the explosion he's usually stronger than a narlox he'll be back I'll be mad. Hmm, okay, we will be waiting. We need to rally everyone and prepare for the retaliation. Let's win strike back before Guan catches up. What is a win strike? It's a good thing you have someone smart like me to help you. Yep. You win stride when you want to get somewhere far away in a snap. Oh. Use M to open the map. You'll see a marker. Press it and hold on tight. <laughs> This isn't easy for amateurs. Oh, okay, brilliant. I think that that's going to be some type of uh, fast traveling. So uh, let's do that. What we get? A uh, Hong Kong Unsealing Charm. It uh, removes the seals on um, weapons, soul shields, and accessories and is unable to trade. Okay, let's do that. And uh, we need to press M. And we're going to do that. Of course, we're going to. And this is the marker, guys. See the marker? Okay, let's. No, is it? Of course it is. Done. Is. What we need to do, guys? Oh, hold on. Where we need to go? Okay, press M key to open the map and left click on to win straight to Bamboo Village. Okay, then. Let's do that one, then. Confirm. Let's do it. And there he is. Look, his stupid dance. Yeah, baby, let's do it. And we are going to fast travel. That's really good to know, guys. Okay, okay, here we are. We arrived uh, back to Bamboo Village and I love this place. You know, it's so colorful and so cheerful. It's just really, really uh, nice. I think I think it's really lovely. I love looking on the MMOs at uh, the graphics. That really is something that really attracts me. But there you go. Right. So we need to talk to uh, someone here, maybe. Uh, see who we need to talk to, shall we? No, not, not quite there yet. Um, okay, one thing I find difficult in this game is to find the target locations because we are right there, aren't we? Do we need to do something with this? Definitely not. It's going to be up there somewhere. You see what I mean though? It's not as easy as we think it is. And that is something in this game that I don't really like very much and probably it's the only thing that I don't like. But uh, it is what it is, guys, and... Uh, what need to do is speak with Chengon. All right, so who is Chengon? Where is he? This is not Chengon. That's what is it Chengon? No, no. Okay, let's find Chengon. 
But again, you see, is this guy Chengon? It's just very difficult to uh, find him. He should be right here. One done wrong, guys. No, identify yourself. No. Nope. 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 Um, Chengen, right? Well, there you go. It's not as as easy as it looks, and it doesn't even have a mark on the top of the head, so it's quite difficult to to try to find uh, where you have to go. But there you go. It is what it is. But I definitely don't like that at all. Uh, they should do something different about this because this is the first MMO that I find getting lost to hang in a quest. But there you go. As I said, this is what it is. Let's be happy. Master Doden. His father, Captain Dochen, requested his presence right away. You should join them. I remember the first time I tried wind striding. It was so harrowing I was sick in bed for a whole week. I still have nightmares about it. Well, I feel just fine. Well, uh, that's because your wind stride was so short. Indeed, it was practically walking distance. I had to return from the Sentinel Coast, which is miles away. Yeah, of course you did. You may think you're fine. But you'll feel sick soon. I'm telling you, wind striding isn't for the faint of heart. So then why you said? Would you rather walk everywhere? Yes. I think not. Just remember, you must first travel to a place on foot before you can wind stride there. Alright, so there you go. Well, basically is telling you that you need to discover a place in order to fast travel to it. So that is what we're basically saying. You'll pick it up. You should get going to Captain Dochen's residence. To keep the masters waiting. Okay, and complete uh, chapter three as well. Okay, so we need to uh, speak to Dojun, as he said. Uh, press uh, M to open the map and navigate to the symbol, then uh, speak with Dojun. Okay, so can we fast travel to that as well? That's what we're saying. I uh, know we need to navigate to it. Oh, so it's in here. Okay, so why two of them? I don't understand this. Right, okay. It is what it is, guys. It is what it is. Very, very confusing, this um, travel method. Or, or, or better said, the uh, quest tracking system is just terrible. Terrible in this game. That I really hate that with passion, but there you go. I think that that is going to be the way it is. And we need to get on along with that. I don't think uh, nobody's going to do anything about it. So why moan about it? <laughs> you tell me about it. Right, let's go in. Right here. Come on, dude. Oh, it takes ages to load the, the, the game as well when you go through uh, these little portals as well. And, oh, they're here. You see, it's just... Uh. Right, I'm not saying anything else. I'm not saying anything else. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Are you all right? I heard you clashed with Guan, captain of the Black Ram. I am sorry for my son's reckless actions. I am in your debt. I have commissioned scouts from the guard to look for any sign of Jin Soyeon and her henchmen. I suspect she will be hard to miss. In time, we will find her. I know it has been tough for you dealing with the loss of your master in school. Please treat this village like home. In all the chaos, I haven't had the luxury of introducing you to my family. You've met my adventuresome son, Dodan. I also have an adopted daughter, Nam so Yu who has been with us for quite some time. She's the one who cared for you in the healing house. Actually, she should be arriving any minute now. Okay, let's complete the quest. That's what I'm talking about. That's not true. Oh. So, what's the matter? Like this? Huh? Like hey, this? you. <laughs> Okay, level 7, we just leveled that. That lovely cinematographic, that is really cool. And I try to be very, very fair when I criticize games. And what is nice is nice, and what isn't, it isn't. And you know what? If you stick in my channel, you will find that that lot with me. I always tell you the truth, especially what I think wrong 
or no. Uh, I, I, you know, I tried to uh, say what's in my heart, and, and based on my experiences of playing MMOs, you know, I'm trying to uh, say the truth about what I think, and I think that that was a beautiful cinematographic, lovely graphics, the mechanics of the games are lovely, the storyline is awesome, but the quest tracking system is as crap as it could be. That is my personal opinion, so there you go. You're safe, how wonderful! I've heard all about what you and Doden did to Guan. Ah, it was nothing. He was nothing. You are far too modest. Everyone's talking about you. In fact, the villagers came together to give you a gift of gratitude. Mm, very nice. It's only a piece of a soul shield. I know it's not much, but we tried. Please accept this humble gift. Right, this is really interesting now. We need to really listen to it, because what is a soul shield? That's the question. And soul shields in this game are really important for your builds. So let's listen. You've never used a soul shield? I guess that's good. I was worried you already had a better one. They help you out in all sorts of ways. Strength, defense, and speed. I don't know how soul shields work, but they do help you train and win battles. So how do I use this? Soul shields go into your inventory. Press B to open the soul shield tab in your inventory. Then... Drag the soul shield and place it in the equip soul shield slot. You can also equip with right click. Easy, right? Yeah. That's it. Let's see how your new soul shield looks. Okay, well, let's see it as well. So we need to press a B or, yeah, I was going to say or I for inventory, but no, it's B for back. And okay, so what this thing does. Right, uh, obviously it's a set of three, as you can see. Increase accuracy by two, increase block by seven, and accuracy by ten, and defense by four. Right, so, um, what we do, let's right click on it, and there we go. We've got equip soul shield. Now, that is equipped, and whatever, effectively, what you have to do is just fill up the whole uh, pentagon, I think it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, no, an hectagon. You need to fill up that completely completely okay in order to be effective and, and as you can see we done the first one and then you can have uh, side ones and all that kind of thing but uh, there you go uh, this is exactly the same one isn't it a uh, militia training soul shield yeah let's go to for that one she gave this last one for that you go okay guys so this is the what the i will do a guide about this guys because i need to explain this much better to you and that's what we'll do okay so this is chapter four we finished chapter three i'm going to leave it here and then we will do a chapter every episode guys so we don't get lost we don't lose track of it i think overall a very beautiful uh, game and i hope to see you in the next episode please come in subscribe and like and i'll see you then